Sasa good security serikali ndio itatakiwa ikupatie security. Ni sababu tuko na police, tuko na AP, tuko na hata ikifika kiwango hapo tunataka tuna, tuna jeshi siko hata tuko na GSC tuko hata na jeshi. Na na oro kila mtu ako na kazi ile hii anatakiwa afanye. Hatuwezi kuita jeshi kwa mambo kidogo kama hiyo. Hata GSC hutaki. Lakini tuko na wao hapa kwa muhimu. Na wakati mwingine inabidi tukiketi kama security committee ukiiticha tukuletee. Sababu ni kuiticha unaiticha. Eh? Kama sasa mnaona nimekuja hata sina askari. Isipokuwa mhuru mmoja tu. Kwa nini? Kwa sababu hakuna fujo. Kuna amani. Lakini kama mungekuja na marungu na vimbo na mipindi eh? Sasa nami ningeanza kusema sasa kaunti police commander weka watu hivi sawa sawa na hata hiyo ziwa wewe waweko na la ona hati kwa sababu hawa watu sioni ni sio sitajiba mema kwa hiyo ukiitisha chie si huko tare mtaleta lakini wanaleta kufanya nini kupiga watu wetu kwa nini wounds nime tumefanya hivi kwa kiraisi unajua kuna wengine hata wakora wanatumia mkutano yako sio wewe uliwaita lakini wanakuja wakitaka kuharibu mambo yako ama kuharibu kuimba we have done a very simple thing here as a security committee me tekanisha politics and criminality tuko pamoja if you pull we have no problem with politics because we are in a political time and you must be given an environment to do your politics those who are going to hide and bring criminality tutawatoa tu na tumeanza kuwatoa kwa sababu agun hata sijui anafanya nini kwa kwa kwa, kwa siasa in fact if anything wale wanatumia guns you end up chasing your votes scare or scatter i want to give you a very good uh, good case wakati mzuri mwingine ni mzuri patia na examples in one place i was a adio not a kayo in a county commissioner wa wa dc kuna mtu mmoja katika kenya alikuwa juu sana siku ya mchezo wa kampeni one day before the dd siku ya election akawa hapo na watu yake gunzu huko nyuma akitabia kiongea okay, mafumazuri sera na linda nini na gunzu anakuja waki akionyesha alama ya huyo pati ya huyo wakatai wananchi wakatai kuonyesha hiyo Unajua nini walikuwa wanafanya? Walikuwa na tarifa na kitu tunaita nyaho hiyo. Ile mfereji ya nini? Kiboko. Wanachapo. So what was happening is hawa watu walikuwa na chapa kunza walikuwa na chapa. Kumbe walikuwa sapata wa wa huyu mtu. Sasa wanaanza kusema huyu sasa. Sasa sisi nafsi tulikuwa tunafuata na gari yetu ya security. Tunakuta watu wanalamika kama kama teka saidi. Na sasa nini? Si hawa watu wanatupina kwa hiyo tutaitishwa kula kwa nguvu hata mimi nilikuwa nimpatie kesho na sasa kesho nitapatia ule anapigana na yeye and i want to tell you from here that person lost yet he to the assessment yake ilikuwa ilikuwa inaonyesha hapo na hapo one lakini kwa sababu ya those goods akapoteza his opponent was in foreign closely benefited from that fight what am i saying if you go that route You also like to lose lose number point number two. and this is a moral question you have to to fight a vote amefanya makosa gani ndio atadikwe eh now as i study here nilichukua kula hapa 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 tu na unataka kula hiyo hapa sio sasa ukuja kutadike na unitarajia ni kupiga ni kupigia kura i can assure you this one you can take it to the bank umeipote umeipote so let us preserve our voters we need them you need them tuko pamoja hapo so for the goods wale wanafikiria ati tukiko mchezo sasa mimi naambia county security team na hapa mimi hata nawaambia ndio kitu kingine nataka niseme hapa kazi yangu ni kuongea mimi mnaona ninaongea sahihi
Ukuweza kabisa don't do this, don't do this, do this, don't do that. Ikifika sasa ukiingia hiyo right tunasema ya criminality hata uko wewe ni mwanasiasa. <coughs> Mimi na <coughs> I always maintain my line. My line is very simple. Ya kuonya, kuelimisha, kuogelesha. Tuko pamoja. Na hii nitafanya mpaka siku ya mwisho. Mpaka uchaguzi safari. Ukiingia line hii ingine ya criminality sasa hiyo mimi sikuenda kigajo na sikuenda ipakasi wale walienda kigajo na ipakasi ni hapo naona wanavaa hiyo yu uniform kuna sasa wewe umetoka lugha yangu ya kuongea sasa mtaingia lugha yako na hapo sasa mtafanya nini mtaele sana <coughs> mwelezane na nakataa kumwambia haitakuwa lugha nzuri tunaelewana na msipatie hawa hiyo kazi unataka hata wao wakae na mtaimu mambo ya guns nimemaliza haya unajua naambiwa ya kwamba ni akina kwa wanaume ndio wanaleta hatari niliona mkutano akina mama pia wanachangia hila hii shida kwanza unatoa duru ya mama akipiga duru hapa ile vita itaanguka hapo utashangaa Eh? Kuna wengine akina mama. Kwa mikutano hiyo. Wao ndio wanapiga ile duu. Ya juu kabisa mpaka watu wanapiga. Wanapiga. Hatutaki. Kuna hapa tunaishi makabila mengi. Kuna watu najua kukusu ndio wengi. Kuna wanaiteso hapo. Pande huyu mwingine tuna sabaoti hapo kwa mlima. Ukienda huko chini kuna wakamba kuna wanjaruo kuna wakikuyu tunataka vile tunaishi kabla ya siasa tuiendelee kuishi kabla na hata baada wakati na hata baada ya siasa najua nilikuwa hapa wakati wa 2007 nilikuwa dio wana hapa Mount Teleon na nilisukuka Kenya nzima wakati hiyo ndio nilikuwa nafikiri just before 2007 election nilitoka hapa nilipoti hapa February na kuna kati nilikuwa natoka Tanga River nikazunguka hii dunia yote mpaka Tanga River Mombasa Mombasa Garissa nikakuja nikatokea Nyeri nikakuja Kenya was a very wonderful country before to 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 hakuna mtu angekuuliza unatoka wapi na unaenda wapi but kwa wakati wa ujinga yetu wakati tulianza hii maneno ya siasa ya 2007 na vita sasa tukaanza kuangalia na pahali mtu ametoka. I want to also to submit to you. Kuna pahali ni safi. Before that phenomenon. Na nirudi kuwa county commission na pahali hiyo tena. Ma biashara ile ilikuwa inafuma wakati nilienda. Nilikuwa nauliza hii biashara ilienda wapi? Wale watu walikuwa wanakuja kununua chakula yenu hapa walienda wapi? Kwa sababu nilikuwa na anasoko kila pahali. Aniambia hii kitu najua ilihalibiwa wakati wa wakati wa vipi? Wa vita all of us lost we also need one one another and i want to kupokeza kugoma the feedback nimepata ni kwamba watu kule kwingine watu walikuwa wanatorokea wanakuja bugo muliweka amani mulitambua umuhimu wa hata hizo kabila zingine na ndio sababu hata saa hii biashara zenu hazikuwa afrika zaidi we still need one another during I mean before, during and after election. Haya hapa night meetings. Najua anaanzia za mwelezo zangu. Mikutano hapa na pale, hapa na pale. Ni najua anga watu wakati unafanya night meeting. Mikutano sio baya. Ile kitu muhimu ni ukitaka kufanya mkutano wako ujulite nani? Ujulite police. Security. Na ile ushauri atakupatia take it for what it is. Unaelewana? Wakati mwingine unaweza kuja kwangu nikwambia ndugu yangu hapo, hii mkutano usifanye. Kuna sometimes you get information about how much I. So we can advise you against it. And the one we give you this advice, it is for your benefit and for our benefit. Tuko pamoja. Tukubaliane hapa 
lakini tunamsaidia mfanye mikutano yenu because after all it's only four months after four months tutakuwa sasa tumerudi kwa hali yetu ya kawaida ya kawaida inform the police so that during the day or even when you want to have a night but i want to discourage night meeting haya kwa matanga kwa matanga a very popular area and i know why kwa matanga kwa harusi wanasiasa ananiambia wananiambia wana county commission wanajua ni chakula ya mwanasiasa ni nini ni watu wanajua hata wengine hawajui hivyo mwanasiasa akikuja hapa muone hapa sasa sasa hata atasahau nyinyi ni nani eh atafurahi sana na anataka akuje ajenda yake wapi hapa there's nothing wrong with that but then is please ikiwa ni masishi huyo mtu amefiriwa na family yake anataka siasa wakati huo honest he doesn't nimeona masichi mwana siasa ameingia watu wamekaa mzuri na kote wakati mwingine hata kuna wageni nimeona county ingine juzi alipokuja hata ku he doesn't he did not even scan the environment ajue ni nani hako kulikuwa na wakubwa wengi wafanyikazi wa serikali wageni kutoka sehemu zote za Kenya akakuja maneno hata mimi mwenyewe nilikuwa nazungumza huyu mtu atataja ataja kuongea ni because whatever he talked does not reflect the severity we have in Kenya akasahau kabisa hako kwa masi hata watu wakaanza kunugunika kule na kule now do you think that politician went with a lot of marks hajijichucha hapa and some of them are the voters me i was not a voter i was just a visitor but i see it if i was a voter in that particular place who had a secret chakula and i was with many people in that line so he kwa ni mazishi enda patia na pole yako eleza watu unasimama na kwa sababu ni kwa masichi utakuja kuwaoka kula kikao kingine hapa umesko kuna mmoja alifanya akiingia akampackage message yake mzuri sana aliyokea siasa lakini hakuna watu ni watu wale ambao waelevu sana wanajua aliyokea siasa he packaged the message in a way that it was actually to to to, to grief the deceased kuna wengine wanaenda huko hata wanaacha vita alikuwa masi hata kwa kanisa ama kwa misikiti usifanye hivyo kwa sababu tunataka kuwe na ama amani ya mwisho ni vijana wangu wa boda boda i know they are also a hot kick vijana wa boda boda ni watu ni wengi ni wazuri kwa sababu in every county they are the critical mass they are organized and they have visibility so everybody would want to have them and i hata hapa wakati nikuja ni kama kila mmoja quite a number of them were aligned to political camps and it was a big source of insecurity nimekubaliana na sistemi wasiogereshwe sistemi wao wasiombe kula lakini i also want them kwamba hiyo kazi yao ya boda boda ni biasha ni biashara na kila mtu ali anachunga biashara nini yake we don't want the boda boda to be misused for political mischief tutaki tu boda boda watumie viba vipaya tunataka boda boda waendeshe biashara yao na wasi kutumike kuharibu amani ya wananchi kwa sababu akifanya hivyo hata wao na boda zao zitashukuliwa na polisi wengine watasitakiwa na hizi boda boda wamenenua kupitia kwa jia ya roho sasa akiheri maneno si boda boda itaenda na kazi itaenda kwa hivyo hapo pia tumekubaliana ya kwamba eh wapi utu yote ambaye atakwenda kwa boda boda achunge sheria na hata wao wenyewe wachunge nini sheria kwa kifupi kimalizia ni hivi as the county commission na security team yangu i want to assure you 
that ours is to give you an enabling environment to do your politics. That is your expectation from us. Uh, my expectation from you also is you do your politics and create an, an, an environment of peace. You become a peacemaker. Don't become a part of the problem, become a part of the solution. Number three, we are all in this together. In fact, IEPC, I depend on you because you hold the sway in terms of law enforcement. IEBC will be the first complainant to police. Akiwa kwa kufanya makosa hana jela yake hana polisi yake. Polisi ni hawa hawa tu. Na hawa polisi wewe hata wewe wakati umesumiwa salama yako ama macho yako yametichwa si utakuja hapa. What I expect when that happens? Sasa kwa mara mingi mtu ananipigia simu kama kwa michina na pigwa na yafanywa nini? Sasa when somebody threatens you I also expect you to go and make a statement in the police station. Uko pamoja. Kwa sababu wengi wengi watu wengi wanaumiana hapa na pale wanarumu police lakini ukienda kwa police station hakuna nini? Hakuna statement. How will the police investigate that case? Ukitishwa kwa hii siasa fanya statement. My expectation is that you are going to do that. Uh, political party madam Ruzi. I think hii sasa kazi yetu sasa ndio iko. Na political party eh, IEBC na wale wengine na wale wanaitwa National Cohesion and Integration Commission. Ya? Hata wao wako na report hapa tayari. Kwa hiyo chunga tu. Uko na watu wengi wamekuja. Sisi katika ofisi yangu tuko na watu ya peace. Mambo ya kuongea mambo ya ya amani. So what I'm, I want to finish by saying this we cannot succeed in Bugoma unless all of us come to be counted. Tuko pamoja. My appeal, my appeal ni hivi. Tufanya hii uchaguzi before, during, and after. Kwa jia ya nini? Ya mani. Of course, yule ya takosa yu mkatama. Kwa jia sisi tuko kasi ni pia. Even me as a county commissioner, Niko kasi? Hata nitafunga ofisi sasa, ofisi na kukuja ukuja mapema asufui. Hii ingine takuwa mkiingia huku na hata mimi takuwa naingia huku kutu. Kwa kikicha unafanya nini? Kuangalia ni nani ya na kusupua na ni nani ni wewe unasupua. Kikuwa unasupua. Lakini sisi ya mini hapa kuna watu wa kusupua. I want to thank you most sincerely and uh, let's aspire to have a very peaceful election.